Hello everyone, this is New AM Group from USW. I would like to introduce our application with all, which is also the assumed tool from course COMP9321, web application and software. I will introduce our application into four steps. Firstly, I will show you the main function and uh, show its uh, basic process. Secondly, I will combine the code to demonstrate how it works. Thirdly, I will introduce our database structure design and I will introduce some creative features at last at last okay let's begin from its main page okay this is our main page as we can see we can do some search function from here the first search is simple search as we type in any string in here like math and click search it will search all the field stored in the database and to match the string math as we can see we can get this item and for the use of for the use of advantage search uh, you can add some condition limited for example <clears throat> if we select item name and we click type in math click add one search it will search the item which uh, is item name contains the string math uh, for the next process we must to log up log in our username and password if we don't have one we can register a new one firstly click register okay so uh, you cannot type any you cannot uh, use any username because some username has already been registered by other users example if you type test and then click next you will find that this test this username will already be occupied so you need to change it like uh, add one afterwards oh still happens two yeah there we go and uh, set your password set those information and for the email and I always use my email for the use of a test afterwards we fulfill the other detail like phone number yeah you can you can search your birthday in the calculator credit card yeah here you can choose what what kind of a user you are there are two buyer and the seller there are different functions for different type of user for seller you can upload the new item and you can change the status of the item for the buyer you can um, purchase the item and also you can put the item into the cart and remove it firstly we decide to establish a user as seller so sublate this is the process this application sending email while um, TCP 
TCP protocol. As we can see, we just need to go to the register email and find the email information. Click the active the button. That means this um, this user has been activated. So if we type the information, we register like uh, test two and the password password. Click login. You welcome test two. It will show us. And also you can see the password password or not so there are uh, mainly user page for the seller if we click my bookstore like this as we can see this is the user information for this user uh, you can change some information but uh, like username or the email you cannot you cannot change it because it's very important for the next processing such as proceeding sending email and uh, uh, validating Sellers also can manage uh, its item. For example, if we want to upload a new time, new item, we just need to upload it. Access computer first as test two. That means the book is edited by is created by himself. Also edit edited by himself. Title. CMP basic theory. CMP UTR. Yes, there we go. And then we can upload the picture as well. Okay. Okay, there we go. This one. The submit. Yeah, as we can see, there is the there is the item has been uploaded on the application. So, if we click the item, we will find the information. We just register registering. We can also change the status by click this button. For example, now the status of uh, the book computer is online. If we click post and click confirm, it uh, become post and uh, click active. It will be when the book is online, you can search. You can search it from the main page yes there we go but if we change the status as post then you cannot search it yeah we cannot find it And also we can see some orders, which means the item already be put some be put into some orders of other people. Then the seller will know the status or how many items of his or hers already be put into others order. Okay, after this, I will, in, I will continue to show some function based on sell, um, buyer.
this time. So test test is a buyer are already established. So click my bookstore. The buyer have the different menu with sellers. For the first one is also the user information. For my card, this means all the item in this card list has been put put into this user's card. Uh, how to put a new item into this card? Let me show you. For example, CMP9322. Click it, then click card button. That's that will pop up or confirm pop and click yes. You can find that the new type new item has been input into the card page. In this card page, you can delete all or buy all. And also you can click on it and delete one and buy one. Let's return back and have a try for CMP9336. Click it and delete it. Delete it. In success, and we will not find these items again. And also, if we want buy, we click it. And waiting for the email validation. And the whole process of proceeding is actually two parts. Firstly, we have the order request. So the item information we are adding into the order list. But the status is waiting for confirm. That means you need to confirm it by other verification function. This is the function I mentioned before. Is the email valid validating function. So we need to come into our and find 